Hi everyone. In this video, we're going to cover the keywords section of Cash Cow Pro. So if you head over to keywords, the first thing you'll see is ranked from highest to lowest all your products by BSR. And you can quickly change this to page views or to position, starting with BSR. Uh, and then what you, if you want to look into the detailed section for keywords for a particular product, hit detailed look and what this will do is it will open up the keyword section for that particular product. So first of all, the tracking tab, what this shows is your BSR and how it's been performing, your page views and your sessions. It shows your keyword list and the approximate volume of searches based on Google and Amazon, a proprietary calculation of what we expect the keyword searches on Amazon to be. Um, and then the position for that particular keyword and the page, how it's changed over one day, seven days, and 30 days. It's We've just added these keywords, so there's not gonna be any 30 day changes. But basically, so this position, this product for Pigeon Sparks is ranked, is on position 12, i.e. it's on page one. And Amazon's experimenting with different pages. So some pages have 14 products, some have 16, some has 32, some have as much as 50. So whether it's on page one or not depends on whether Amazon's displaying 12, 15, 30 products on the page at that particular time. We've noticed they've been doing some A-B testing for that. So in this case, uh, this product is in position number two on page one. You can add or edit keywords by typing in here, keyword, and then hitting save or Using your keywords here, your search terms will create a list of suggested, suggested keywords, which you can then add into your keyword list and then save and track as well. At the same time, if you go over to page analysis, for each one of those keywords, so this is for your, your, your main product, so this is this particular product, shows you whether your title length, matches the optimal, whether your features is at least the same as the minimum, your images, yep, you've got five high-res images and we recommend at least one, so it's a tick. Title length minimum 100 characters, it's 193, so it's a tick. Your review rating is 4.3, but we recommend 4.5, so it's a cross, it's a warning sign. This needs to be optimized, this product. The reviews, we recommend at least 700. The higher your reviews, the higher your conversion and the least comp less competition you're gonna have. This product has two, five, three reviews, so we recommend increasing the reviews over time. Characters in the description, we recommend at least 1,000 plus. It has 1,500, so it's a detailed explanation. And we recommend that the product is FBA. Below, you can see for each one of your keywords from the tracking section that you put in, we have the it analyzes your particular product to see whether it's in the title, yep, in the features, yep, in the search terms, no, in the description, yes. So all of these main keywords are missing from our backend search terms, so we need to go in and make sure we put those in. So if you've selected keywords in the tracking, this is just a double check to make sure you're actually using them in your title, features, description, and search terms. Really quick snapshot, you can do that for all products, and if you wanna change products, you just click here, and select the product that you want to analyze. Final section is the keyword matrix. So if we're thinking of using a keyword, let's take bird tape. And what it will do is it will scan uh, Amazon, the position one through to 16, and show whether that keyword is being, how that keyword is performing Boom, there we go. Okay, so is it in the features for this first position one product? It's not, it's in the title, it's in the description. They have seven plus images and five plus features. In this case, position two only has one image, has five features. They're not using the bird tape keyword in the title. They're using it in the features and the description. So what this lets you do for a particular keyword is to see whether it's being used. And here, mostly you see green. So that means that keyword is being used a lot. It's quite a competitive keyword. And then what you're also seeing is that nearly all of them have all the features and all the images. So it's just a quick way of analyzing the competition for a particular keyword 
Here you can analyze whether you've used them all and here you can track your position over time. So if you're doing a promotion, you want to track, you'll be able to track your keyword performance also.